and you're the same. For every challenge that you've ever been through, the fact that you're still sitting here means you've come through them. And every time you come through a challenge, you've got the ability to come through it again. So there's a couple of messages that are gonna happen throughout this weekend. One is just to be resilient, keep showing up, don't quit ever. Just don't quit, just keep moving. What did you learn in there, bro? Uh, I learned about self-discipline and how you have to give it 100% of your efforts. Yeah. And you have to give everything the best go you got and don't, don't half-ass anything. You have to be as strong as you can and do your best. I um, learned, um, I actually did, uh, made no excuses. There's no excuses. There's always someone doing worse than what you're doing. If someone's better than you, find out what they're doing better and be better than them. What do we got in the morning, boys? Are we gonna... Two hour workout. Fat workout. Yeah. Explain what dog squat is. Horrible. Nah. No. Great, but hard. Makes me vomit. <laughs> <laughs> Put a, a 200 meter gap on the last person. Is that really what a team does? I know there's some athletes in here, and then there's boys that aren't athletes. If you boys can help each other through this time, you will grow as people. And that's one of the lessons, one of the first lessons that we'll get out of today. It's a new day, it's a new world, we all winning. I'm up late, up early, I gotta get it. Keep working, now we gotta make a million. young fellas you'll learn that when you get the right people around you the energy changes and you all start to lift a level so that was really good effort today I know you're all at different levels all I ask for them is to not quit and just keep pushing themselves to whatever their limit is but you guys that came in and then packed that up and brought the right energy and the right attitude that was awesome all you gotta do is put your mind to it wake up I'm on to the next new day I gotta do my best uh, every day I put the work in the grind never stop you ain't never see me rest See me on top, I never fall. I speak my truth and turn it to law. Do it for the drive, you know it's really my passion. Never gonna stop me, really, I'll make it happen. Uh, I gotta get up and grab it. Huh, the money want me to have it. What more could I say? I'm top billing. I grew from the dirt, guess I had to make a million. I grew up, I swear I rose from the valley. Every day I put the work in, I gotta keep a tally on beat. Pockets stay heavy when you see me, don't leave. Falling days in the streets, had homies in the struggle. some nerves from these young men because every one of them is going to get up and going to tell us something that they've taken away from this camp. I'm Jacob and I learned that the, um, the energy in a room really helps you get through whatever you're doing. When everyone else is positive, you're feeling positive and you can do whatever as long as you've got the right people around you. And these boys are all good. Yeah. Uh, my name's Ben and the thing that challenged me the most was actually leadership. I'm not usually in leadership roles at my school, not very popular, but with all these boys around, like with my group, group one, I had to help um, Winar with his pack to climb up. You got up pretty well, didn't you, mate? Yeah. You went well, but we've all helped each other out. When we got to the top, we've all shared around water and just had a great time overall. Hey guys, my name's Alizé, I'm 17. Uh, when, it first, when I first heard about it, Dad told me hey, about the bro camp, I was not interested at all. Weekend away from home, I wasn't feeling it. I came Friday, good mix of little, oh not little, young men now. Good mix of young men. And yeah, Saturday we climbed the hike, 
That was tough. Had bags everywhere. One bag on my back, one bag on my shoulders. Uh, hello, my name is Corey Nakaili. I'm a Redcliffe rugby player. I live in Redcliffe. Um, this weekend, I went into Bros Camp. A lot of obstacles we faced. It was really fun. Recommend it to everyone. And it's a good place to, good way to get out of your comfort zone. Uh, so guys, we've just finished our inaugural Bro Camp event. It's our first 48 hours, 11 to 17 year old men. And to say that this surpassed all expectations of us is amazing. Um, to watch these young men transition, they did everything, physical challenge, they got up and did public speaking, and they culminated with actually talking in front of their parents and other adults about the positives of what they got out of this camp. Now, it wasn't about that, it was about standing up and delivering to adults. It was amazing to see this transformation from young men who wouldn't even speak when they first walked in here. So, a resounding success, and we, we have really built a foundation to know how to make this bigger, better, stronger, and we're gonna take this thing nationally.